Okay, hello YouTube, this is going to be a video review of the M65 pants liner. The um, main color is olive drab. If you've seen these or not, they're actually pretty cool. So they have uh, buttons all the way at the side. If you wanted to um, take them off or whatever, you can unbutton them pretty easily. Um, let me see, there's one big button right here in the middle with the, the crotch part open for some reason. Pretty big opening actually. And it has buttons on the button holes where it would uh, attach to the M65 pants. The button system. There's two there and then there's one middle and another one in the middle here and then two on the back you see them or not right there and then right there okay on the inside it'll have the tag num name hold on let me move it down a little bit move it down a little bit so you can see okay the tag names right here tells you what it is you can see it or not blurry and then it says what size it is I got the size large short regular which it's just my size, I guess, in this. Because it's two different sizes, actually, because it's size range, I guess. Okay, so. Minor cold weather trousers. Field. I think it says field. Yeah, it does say field, right? One of those words in the middle. Okay, but this is a. It's a quilted, quilted uh, pant liner, same material as the, uh, the Wooby poncho liner, but this is thinner than the um, pants. The pants are actually more thick. You can actually compress them down and actually thicker. So it might be double, double or more of the padding that's in a poncho liner. Okay, no more on that, but um. The buttons are all legit military ones that you would find on the normal uh, crotch portion of the BDU pants, and then the um, on the same on the cargo pants. Okay, more onto the pants. Okay, so this portion here is a reinforced different color layer on the side, which looks nice. It has the uh, reinforced on the inside. It has stretchy, I think, right here on the back portion. There's stretchy. When I tried it on, it's stretchy. Okay, um, let me show you now. So, so when you wear this, you probably don't want to wear this in public with the opening like that. Because your underwear and crotch will be hanging out. What I do to uh, change that was I have a pair of loose-fitting, um, what are they called, like, Leisure pants, these actually fit under, or over top of the, uh, liner pants and work pretty well. There's no brand name for these, I don't know where I got, I got them from the thrift store. It just tells what size they are, extra large. These are nice, but I'm not reviewing those. And then I also use these ones with it also, the, um... The one with the buttonhole and the nuts right here. Completely stretchy material. These are a brand name. Fruit of the Loom. Polyester. Uh, pants. Whatever. Blah, blah, blah. It doesn't tell you. It's size large. They work with it also. Okay, um. Oh, let me show you what's on the back. If there is anything different. So on the back, it's just a big old seam. Big old seam down the back. The pant legs don't have any, um, what do you call it, like shock cord or anything for them. So, I don't know if that's uh, important or not, but showing that anyway. <clears throat> you can fold them over <clears throat> pretty easily for storage. And the knee right here, I guess, because it's shorter by a little bit. The knees, like right here, there's a part of the 
fabric that's like folded over a little bit more so you can bend. You can see it right here in the fabric. This part and this part. Okay, you are in the video.